What it is, Tubies, boy Ryan Anthony. Back with another one, man. You know what we're talking about with the boxing, man. Uh, let's get to it. Uh, it's been a lot of back and forth between these two fighters, and and then it, you know, what I'm saying it's finally getting getting announced on the zone. They're saying it's coming soon. They ain't put a date on it, but it's most definitely happening. You know, on this channel, we talk about the fights that's most definitely finna happen. We ain't talking about future fights. It's, it was a while before I even talked about uh, Earl Spencer and Crawford because it wasn't, I'm not bringing y'all no news. I don't have no sources or none of that. All I give is my opinions on fights and breakdown fights or how I think the fight gonna go when it's signed, sealed, and delivered. You know what I'm saying? Ready to be delivered. But now that, you know what I'm saying? So now that turns Crawford and Earl Spencer, I gave y'all that. But uh, we're gonna get get uh get, get on this fight, man. Um, Sonny Edwards and uh, Ben Rodriguez, Jesse Rodriguez, man, uh, flyweight fight, you know, uh, uh, unification bout, gonna be nice, you know, uh, these two been going back and forth, really Sonny Edwards been, he been going at them, thinking, you know what I'm saying, saying they scared of him and all that, man, uh, <laughs> but Bam was like, you know, you know, he got his uh, jaw broke his last fight, which I said Christian Gonzalez, man, might, you know what I'm saying, they kind of fight similar, but Bam just the better, the better version. He end up hurting them, you know what I'm saying? He, you know, but it, it didn't look like he hurt him, but he, you know, he landed him good, some good shots and ended up breaking the um, Bam uh, jaw. But you know, Bam won it, won that fight most definitely won it. But you know, it is what it is. But he said, uh, you know, once I recover, it's, it's nothing. That's why I think they kind of holding off the date. Cause uh, I think when you uh you get hurt like that, it's like you most definitely like suspended for like six months or whatever. So who knows when that fight gonna when that fight gonna happen? But you know what I'm saying that that fight can all <laughs> damn the six months. And as soon as he get better, he probably hop back in there. But I don't know. I don't know how it's gonna go. But the def the fight most definitely gonna go down. And I can't wait for it. Uh. I think I got, I think, uh, I think I got Bam winning this, man. I do, uh, Sonny, Sonny Edwards' last performance, man, he, it was, he was good, but he showed, like, vulnerability in the inside. Uh, I think he, 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 he does better on the outside. He does way better on the outside, but his last fight, it showed, like, he was doing good in the inside work. It was just because of the, I think, the caliber of fighter he was facing. Ben Rodriguez knows how to cut off that ring. Uh, he can box on the outside a little bit, but his goal is to get in there. His goal is to meet you in the phone booth and, and break you down. He got a good jab, solid puncher, solid puncher. You know what I'm saying? Got, got a nice defense. He, you know, he keep his hands right here or whatever. Um, yeah, Bam a solid fighter solid fighter and I think that would be the kryptonite to Sonny Edwards who he more flashy you know what I'm saying uh he like a he like a little gifted look he he, he 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 real twitchy you know can he can move I think his best bet is to stick on the outside you know stick with his jabs and he you know he make up make up punches and all, all that but then he you know he, he caught, try to show his grit he go in the inside but or whatever, but I don't think that's his. Uh, I don't really think that's his forte. You know what I'm saying? I don't think that's his special, special, speciality. You know what I'm saying? I don't, I don't specialty. I mean, that's, I don't think that's his special. You know, uh, and, and when it comes to a band who's kind of like on, on on the same level as you. And he's very good at cutting off the ring. He's going to make you fight. Because Sonny Edwards will fight. And it's going to be a time where uh, Bam is going to close that distance. He's going to make him fight. Because Bam is just that good at cutting off that ring. And he's a solid fighter. He's he, he's fundamentally sound at, at, at the same time. So, Sonny, Sonny Edwards, he's going to be doing all the little flashy movement. But Bam is gifted at cutting off that ring. And he's going to meet him in the inside. Just like Sonny Edwards' last fight. He was cutting off the ring, and he was meeting him in the inside, and, you know, that's where the other guy was getting his uh, rocks off. I forgot his name when he was fighting, man. He's going to come to me. 
but it's probably gonna be right after this video. But anyway, uh, Sonny L was he, he, he was doing his thing, but he showed vulnerability. And um, yeah, I don't think uh, I don't I don't I don't think he would fur in a phone booth fight with Bam. Cause cause one thing one thing for certain two things for sure is that Bam. He ain't your typical inside fighters. Most of your inside fighters, they only like one trick ponies. They come in with hooks. They come in, you know what I'm saying? They come in with hooks and body shots and, and that's it. Bam can do it all. And, and they don't have, and, and, and a lot of inside fighters have very little defense. That's not the case with Bam. Bam got a nice, got a nice solid defense. He ain't just throwing hooks. He, he you know what I'm saying? He, th he throwing jabs, he throwing straight right hands. Throwing uppercuts, going to the body, going to change the levels, he fame, all that, man. He, he very good at that mid range and the inside range. You know what I'm saying? So his best, uh, Sonny Edwards' best bet is just to keep him on the outside and be flashy all night. But I just don't see it happening with a uh, with the caliber of fighter that Van Rodriguez is, who's gifted at cutting off that ring. You know what I'm saying? And you know his uh, coaches, uh, um. Um, his coach is Mikey Garcia's brother, Robert Garcia. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. His coach is Robert Garcia. So, and you know that Mexican style, they teach that good. They teach that very well, and, and they more of an offensive fighter. Uh, he teaches more of an offensive kind of fighter, fight. You know what I'm saying. So to be offensive, and I think Bam with his, his you know, his, his look, the defense, his solid defense that he has is 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 most definitely gonna be okay to fight a Sonny L. Even with all the twitchiness and the flashiness. He Sonny L was to win this fight, he's gonna have to be on a A game. He just gonna have to stick on the inside and when the ring get cut off or whatever, he gonna have to make sure he he he, he uh gets his distance or he gonna have to have Bam's time and down pack. That's the only way I see Sonny L was winning. But Bam is no slouch man. Um uh, yeah. I, I think I see Bam breaking him down and it, it going a distance and uh, Bam winning unanimous decision. Yeah. Uh, uh, but it'd be, it'll be a close fight, but it still be unanimous. I, I see about like maybe seven rounds to five. Close fight, but I, I see, you know what I'm saying, seven five. Uh, it must definitely seven five. Bam, Bam way. I can see it like that. You know, I can see it being a close fight, but I can see uh, uh, Bam being like two rounds ahead and not letting Sonny catch back up. You know, that's how I see that fight. But can't wait till uh, they say it's coming soon. I can't wait till they put a date on it. But that's my breakdown. You know what I'm saying? Uh, be ready to tune in to that fight, man. Y'all be on the lookout for those two, two, two cats, man. Um, yeah, man. So leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe to the channel. Check out my shorts if you want to work it out. If you view 15 seconds or you get all the way through, I appreciate it. But if you're my subscriber, you know it's all good. Ryan Anthony, I'm out.